It is week 27. We are officially in our third trimester. I am in a car right now. Just got done with ooh, meeting my uh, acupuncture slash chiropractor. And oh my gosh, it's been a month since I've seen her. So amazing. She is freaking awesome. I got my neck adjusted for the first time, which was which was cool. <laughs> I feel great. Um, she said my body is seems to be doing well, so I don't have to see her again until another month, um, right before the baby moon. So I'll relax before we go on our baby moon, and then I'll relax some more. But um, I can't believe we're already here at week 27, third trimester. I am noticing my body is limited a little more on certain movements. Like this morning when I was getting out of the shower and like putting on my clothes, bending my legs, like specifically my right side. I feel like baby likes to hang out on the right side, bottom right, which puts a lot of pressure there. Um, so his, I feel like his back is right there on the bottom right, which makes it hard to lift up my leg. <laughs> when I'm trying to put on my underwear. <laughs> like, it, it hurts. Other than that, I feel great. I still have, you know, pretty high energy. Had a really good workout today. Like, did some HIIT. I haven't really done um, HIIT cardio in a while, but my trainer, start, we started implementing that to get my heart rate going. Still getting in my walks. Let me know if you guys wanna see, like, come to the gym with me. I talked to my trainer about it, and I think he's okay with me shooting in there. But, or maybe even just like the workouts that I do during the week, like what my schedule looks like. It's not like crazy, crazy workouts, but um, you know, just trying to stay active. This week, I am making progress on the nursery. Super excited. Uh, gonna be designing, so I already designed the nursery. I'm designing custom pieces to punch, to do some punch needle. And I'm excited because I haven't really done much punch needle. I don't even know if I've done a punch needle. Maybe I'll do a Tiffy Tries. Tiffy Tries content over here. Um, but I'm designing like five different punch needle designs. And I think I might actually make them available for you guys to purchase. I have to look to see like what a punch needle pattern actually looks like. But I thought it'd be so cool for you all to be able to create projects that I'm making for the nursery. Um, so that will come within the next couple weeks and hopefully I can finish the projects this week. More stuff is coming in at the end of this week. This is my birthday week, guys. Oh my gosh, it's my last birthday before being a mommy. My birthday's on Saturday and we're gonna celebrate. So I am probably gonna go shopping, find a nice cute outfit to wear that shows the bump. So that should be fun. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I'm gonna be 34. Ah, age just creeps up on you. But yeah, we gotta take our bump date photo. The bump is getting bigger. <laughs> and yeah, uh, it's gonna be a great week. So let's, let's do it. Let's get it this week. All right, I went and just got my eyebrows laminated. That's why they're so bushy, because, you know, it's your girl's birthday this weekend, so just wanna have some nice brows. I had the very first person who doesn't know that I'm pregnant, doesn't know me personally, ask me if I was expecting. And it was the girl who was doing my brows. <laughs> But I still, I haven't, like when I'm out in the world, I haven't had that experience of people asking if I'm expecting. Um, so this was my first one that I got at 27 weeks pregnant. Feels good, man. <laughs> Just wanted to share that random little tidbit with you guys. Oh, also, um, I wanted to show you guys some updates that I have done. I've been doing some drawing. Let me get this ready. So we nailed down the drawing for the nursery if you've been following our nursery weekly update. And now I started designing some of the wall pieces that I'm gonna be um, punch needling. And I wanted to show you guys the designs. You know, just give you a little sneak peek. So I'm gonna be doing five of them. All of them are different sizes, but 
Um, here is one of the larger ones. There it is. It says, you are my son. And I think I'm gonna get rid of the pom-poms. Instead, I'm gonna do some like fake leaves. The other one that I designed was this one. You are my moon. And then if you guessed it, the very last one, which I just started sketching out, and you are my stars. You are my sun, moon, and my stars. So, still have to finish this guy. Hoping to just sit down and do that today, because uh, I don't have like a super busy schedule, thank God. I feel like every day has just been so busy. Hopefully I can get those done today and then go to the store and start making these things so we can have some progress on the nursery for this week. So yeah, just gave you a little sneak peek. Um, full progress of that will be on our weekly nursery vlogs. Check that out somewhere on the screen if you wanna go watch it. Oh, I also wanted to share with you guys, last night, I don't know if this is a thing, I had my first like pregnancy dream, <laughs> like my first um, negative pregnancy dream where I think I was sleeping and I was just feeling discomfort, like, like a lot of pressure, shortness of breath. I've been feeling a lot of shortness of breath today, but it was in my dream and I had a, a negative dream where I was at Disneyland while pregnant, walking around and I was miserable and so grouchy and uncomfortable and complaining and that was the dream, just feeling discomfort. And then I woke up this morning feeling like I didn't get a good, good night's rest because of all the discomfort that I was feeling in the dream. But I was really feeling in real life. I don't know if that's a thing. I'll have, I'm gonna have to look it up. We're gonna have to look that up and see if pregnancy nightmares <laughs> are a thing. I don't know, who knows? All right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so y'all know it's my birthday weekend. My last birthday without being a mom. <laughs> so I had to treat myself. We got our eyebrows laminated, you knew that. And then I got my nails done, oh my gosh. I haven't had my nails done in a really long time. Having your nails done just does something to you. Feeling and looking real cute with the bump. Gonna do some work to the nursery right now. And I'm gonna go shopping um, probably tomorrow, Friday. I'm gonna give myself a three-day weekend for my birthday, hey! And I'm gonna go buy a cute outfit. And we're gonna dress the bump for my birthday, yay! I can't wait to celebrate. Um, it's gonna be at this spot that has a really nice view. So I'll show you guys the view um, and of course the the fit. <laughs> I might make something for it. I want to kind of dress up the the bump with something shiny. We'll see if I have time. But really excited to continue working on the nursery today. And yeah. day after my birthday we had a really nice birthday celebration I didn't record anything I only got a little snippets here and there but I had a really great time hanging out with friends the view was amazing hubby did a good job booking the place Yay. Um, it was a special one and then we came back here for the after party. The seats were a little low at the restaurant, so it was really uncomfortable for me, like, and the belly. Um, but once I was like standing and kind of like moving around, it was okay. Uh, but I rested the whole entire day so that I would be able to last the night. <laughs> And I'm really glad that I did. So currently, we are just chilling today um, and we're booking the rest of our baby moon. So we're trying to figure out food locations and like 
spa days and like what beaches we want to go to so that is four weeks away like four weeks away as in we will be on a plane in four weeks so uh, I ordered some stuff to wear and I'll probably do like another little I'll do like a try on haul video I love doing the little Instagram like try on videos and um, I got some stuff from free people and then I gotta get some bathing suits and I was like what do pregnant women do about bathing suits? And the maternity clothing hasn't been working out for me. So I'm just going to buy bathing suits that I will wear even after being pregnant. So I found some brands on Instagram that actually got served to me and I've been really curious to try them out. And I kind of want to branch out from like my normal shopping locations for swimsuits. I still haven't found like a really good brand that I like. If you guys have any, please comment down below like your favorite go-to bathing suit brands because I will be buying those this week since we are, we are planning this. And then once that's planned, we can move on to planning the baby shower. It just keeps going and going. But all is well here. We have a class tonight. We've been taking these online natural birthing classes that my friend gifted to me. And this will be our third class. We have one more class after this. So it's four classes in total. And it's like a two and a half hour long class. But super informational. Um, but yeah, we'll let you guys know how the class goes. And... See what we learned. See what we learn in class. All right, we just finished our class and we went over a lot of stuff. We got to see a C-section. I've never seen one before. Me either. I never want to have one. Never want to have one. I'm not going to go that route. That's not on the plan, but... Mm -hmm. uh, well, any of it's absolutely necessary yeah feeling good about this class a lot of really good information i'm glad that you're taking these classes with me because this is like really vital information for you to learn too oh yeah just because like what i mean i'm gonna be in labor like i'm probably gonna be i'm probably gonna forget like most of the stuff that we're going over so yeah i got him on my team he's my he's my partner heck yeah yeah because you you just got one thing to worry about just birthing the baby and yeah. I need your mind to be there and not thinking about all these other things so I'm gonna be your brain yeah he's gonna be my brain he's gonna make sure I'm eating and hydrating and I got him in my corner mm -hmm. making sure you, you you know you're well taken care of yeah but yeah we got one more class to go mm -hmm. and um and then we'll be done with these classes these classes have been so amazing, helpful, super informative. Yeah, I mean, you're not gonna get this education anywhere else. Honestly, no. it's like you it's... actually have to like seek it. Mm -hmm. And this was actually a gift from one of our friends. So. Yeah, but yeah, I just wanted to update you guys on that. We're back to planning the baby moon. <laughs> We're gonna lock it down today. We have to lock everything down today. We got some really good like food recommendations. Mm -hmm. um, so we're locking that down tonight. And then that's the goal mm -hmm. for today. And then next week is nursery stuff. Yes. Next week, meaning tomorrow. Meaning tomorrow. It starts. It starts. Mm -hmm. Like installation workers coming in, getting down to business. Yeah. Like get down, like get down to business. Mm -hmm. We need to take my picture, my bump picture. So yes. we're going to take that tomorrow morning. Yeah. Bump is getting big gonna be a, a pretty big update yeah all right i'll show you i'll show you guys the bump tomorrow 